if we have the expression 5 to the power of 2 divided by 5 over 16 multiplied by 32, then what is the simplest possible answer for this expression? Which option do you think is the correct answer to this question? Everyone thinks this question is so easy, but it confuses almost everyone. Let's break it down and solve it together. And the first step to solve this question, most people go straight to the exponent, which is 5 is squared. And they rewrite this expression as 25 divided by 5 over 16 multiplied by 32. And the next step, they focus on the multiplication between 5 over 16 and 32, because they believe multiplication has a higher priority than division. Alright, as you can see in the image, they simply cancel out 32 with the 16 in the denominator and this expression simplifies to 25 divided by 10, which finally gives them the answer 2.5. And immediately, they conclude that the correct answer to this question is option B. However, this answer is absolutely wrong. Alright, now let's go step by step together and show you how to solve this expression properly. As you can see on the screen, at this expression, first we have an exponent, then a division sign, and finally a multiplication. To solve this question, we must follow a rule that is called PEMDAS. At this rule, P stands for parentheses, E stands for exponent, M stands for multiplication, D stands for division, X stands for addition, and S stands for subtraction. It means that we must perform all the operations in this expression exactly according to the PEMDAS rule in order from top to bottom. Okay, first we must start with the exponent because in this expression, exponent has a higher priority than the other operations. So, instead of this expression, we can write 25 divided by 5 over 16 multiplied by 32. And the next step, we move on to the division and multiplication. However, it's very important to note that multiplication and division have exactly the same level of priority in the PEMDAS row. In this situation, the best approach is to start from the left and move toward the right, performing these two operations in order. So, we are start with the expression 25 divided by 5 over 16. Okay, whenever we see a division sign between two terms, the best thing to do is to apply the KCF row. In this row, K stands for keep the first number as it is. C stands for change the division sign to multiplication. And F stands for flip the second fraction. So, we remove the highlighted part and write this expression as 25 multiplied by 16 over 5. Now, we can easily simplify the number 25 with the 5 in the denominator. And instead of this expression, we can write 80 multiplied by 32. Which finally gives us the answer 2560. That's great. Option D is the correct answer to this question.